Hi guys, this is Chloe and I know I'm not in my usual space right now, but I'm doing another skill series video and it's how to clean and organize your fridge. So I'm so excited to get into this video and on that note, we're gonna get started. So this is my fridge. So you may be wondering why you need to clean out your fridge. So the reason why you wanna clean out your fridge is because the food could get mold on it and it can get really stinky and the best time to clean it out there really is no like best time you can either do it when you have free time like on the weekends and just set aside time on the weekends to do it or whenever you're free or for instance my trash guys come on friday so maybe the day before you can clean out your fridge and that way you'll have it in the garbage for not too long before the trash guys come to pick it up because then your garbage can can get stinky and you don't want that either and there's a couple different ways you can do this you can either a take everything out check and see what's expired or bad and then clean it out like wipe it clean and then put everything back in or what you could do is do it shelf by shelf and take out you know some items on one shelf figure out what's expired and bad wipe it down and then put it back on that shelf there's no like right or wrong way to do this but before you do any of that it is best to check the owner's manual to see how to clean the inside now like I mentioned in my how to change a water filter video, which you you haven't seen that, there'll be a little eye in the corner that you can click and it'll take you to the video. But with that, I had mentioned that there's an app on my phone that came with the fridge and all I have to do is go on the app and it'll tell me how to clean the interior. I should also mention Just for example, but my sh like fridge is like a Lego brick fridge where the shelves are removable. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to literally be taking out the shelves, but I'm going to do it piece by piece instead of doing it all together. So I have one of the shelves out and the app said to use just um, a cloth with some warm water to clean it and then dry it with a towel. And they said no harsh abrasive cleaners and a lot of like fridges will say that. And that just means no like bleach or anything. Cause especially if like for instance, my fridge is stainless steel, and if you were to use bleach, it could like take off the stainless steel coating, and you don't want to do that. But that's just basically what I'm going to be doing. You could like check to see what foods are expired first, if you want to do that first, and then clean it. Again, there's no right way or wrong way to do it. Now, I'm going to check to see what's expired. But first, I grabbed a garbage bag and I'm just going to like leave it on the counter and I am going to be throwing away whatever's expired in this bag. And it's just easier for me. That way I can just put it straight into the garbage can. You could also pull out your trash can and use your trash can if you like. But again, I'm just using a garbage bag. Now, how to tell if something has expired. So I'm gonna use this heavy whipping cream for example. Whoa, but, sorry about that. But basically, it'll have like it says, December 27th, 23 on the top, and that's when it's goodbye. And if it's after that date, then you wanna throw it away. But it's not December 27th, right now so it's still good now as far as food 
So you have to kind of remember when you made this stuff and what you could do too is you can take sticky notes and put on there like the day that you made it. But you also have to know how long each particular thing is gonna last. So like for instance, if you made homemade lemonade, it's gonna last a lot longer than the leftovers that you had from a dinner a couple of days ago, just to give you an idea. But this is some like chocolate and some whip, homemade whipped cream. And I made this myself and it's very old, so I'm gonna be throwing it away. And I'm not gonna, it's like very old, so I'm gonna clean it out, the Tupperwares. Now, I took everything out of this area, but as you can see, that is not removable. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wipe it down and clean it the same way I would if I could remove it. Alrighty, here's the finished product. And I should mention, which I didn't have an issue with this, but some people may come across this. But if you have multiples of the same item, like for instance, if I have multiples of that lemonade, then I put whatever's gonna expire first up front, that way people know to eat that first and or drink it, and then eat or drink the stuff that isn't expired after that one's all gone. But that's basically it. And also, you can wipe down the fridge afterwards but my mom did that yesterday, so I don't have to do that. But how you would do that is you want to check the manual and they'll tell you how to do it and what to use. And that's it. I thank you guys so much for watching this video and I can't wait to see you guys again soon. Bye.